Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to LEGO Island 2. My name is Andy, broadcasting as my Slytherin pseudonym, The Uncommentator. We're now back on LEGO Island. Well, we're actually on Adventurer's Island, but it is of course LEGO Island 2, the name of the game. And we're picking things up in this episode, episode number 5 uh, of the series. So the last episode we drove a uh, that thing, basically that car there, that sand buggy type thing. And we threw some coconuts at some snakes. So we now, uh, we got through, so we got through to the uh, side of the island. And now we need to find some more gems, I believe. So let's crack on with that. Now, at the end of episode four, uh, we were 50% of the way through the game. So, by my reckoning then, by the time we get to the end of the eighth episode, we should have completed this game. So we'll guess we'll find out when we get there. If it works out that way. In fact, I said in the last episode I wanted to try and finish the uh, episode 4 at 50% and I did. So that was uh, that was nice. Right, doesn't appear to be as many gems here as there was on the other side of the island. Um, so, unless they're a different colour of course. But last time the gems were blue and they stood out quite clearly. Whereas this time, well they're not standing out are they? Um... So that's the f that's the gate that we uh, we broke through in that car. Um, right, I'm slightly concerned that we uh, can't seem to see I can't seem to see any gems at all, which is mildly irritating. So maybe we're not looking for gems. I would assume we are though. We're not going to go in the water, even the fact there's sharks in there. I'll tell you what, then let's talk to these people. I'm assuming they're just going to tell us. They're just going to give me some encouragement. I love how startled they are when you try and talk to them. It's a bit shy, dear. Um, what are you going to say for yourself, Dr. Livingston, I presume? And I see another expert in the field. Why, where is he? There's no fields anyway, it's all sand. Um, let's try this car. What happens if we get in this? Can we get in this car? No, we can't. Okay. Can we go in here? No, we can't. Can we... No, we can't. Um, can we go in here? Or is this just a sphinx? Oh. Oh, no, that, no, why is that happening? There we go. If you press the right button, something happens. Right, we'll go in here. Let's see what, let's see what this uh, brings. Is this going to be another mini game? Still no song for this screen. Oh, no, 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 no. What the snakes keep them down, but swipe the gems off for the adventurers. I think you have to double tap to do that, if I remember correctly. Yeah, double tap. Yeah, so this is similar to the uh, the whack a mole thing that we did on uh, episode one. In fact, just before I start this, uh, if anyone's watched episode one, where I uh, hit the uh, the robots, I said on there that it was a similar mini game on Pokemon Stadium. Now, in fact, I was wrong. <laughs> the game I was thinking of was basically you have to throw a coiled up Ekins on a on diglets that pop up out the ground. I was thinking of that. No, you don't, so you don't hit them with hammers. You throw uh, you throw Ekins on them, which is appropriate given the fact we're going to be hitting some snakes right now. So I just wanted just wanted to correct that one in case. Um, I mean, by the time that video makes it to YouTube, somebody may have already commented and said, "Well, actually, Andrew, you're wrong." It's, yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, but it's, uh, we all need to be accurate. Right, anyway, let's crack on with it. So we need to, basically, same principles as uh, that game I've just talked about. But if we double tap, we can swipe the gems. Right, I may go quiet here because I'm going to have to concentrate. Oh, so that's that one. Yeah, there we go, right. The other, th the other difficult thing about this one is, uh, obviously there's no... Um, there's no buttons on the uh, on the screen like there was on the. Uh... Right, we all swiped a gem. There's no buttons like there was on the metal um, when we're hitting the robots. The actual buttons we needed to press for each each thing we needed to hit. I'm not explaining this very well. Basically, there's no buttons, uh, so it's making it a bit more challenging. Um, and also the um, the lids flipping up get in the way a little bit. Um, I'm more about getting the gems than whacking the snakes. I have to say. I'm glad the gems are bright green. It, I was worried they were going to be dark blue. Even more difficult to uh, more difficult to see. I'm actually finding this slightly easier than the uh, the robots. And like I said on that one, it whichever uh, sort of thing they pop out of, it it tells you what to press. Whereas on this one, it doesn't. So you've got to remember. I hope it doesn't go uh, 
I'm, I'm, I'm hoping it doesn't go uh, dark like it did on the uh, the other one. How long's left? 15. Not been too badly this, I don't think. Not when you press the wrong button. Pressing buttons twice now without meaning to. Oh, there we go. Wap Bap Stun Snake. Thanks. Yeah, we'll take that, Silver. Fell off a cliff a bit towards the end. But it doesn't matter. Yeah, the metal sort of cabinet that the uh, the robots pop out of in the game on episode one, they've got the buttons of the PlayStation pad on the bottom of them, so you know which one to press. If the circle flap opens, then a robot pops out, you know to press circle. That, that's the point I was making. Whereas on that one, it doesn't, so you've got to remember. I mean, they're in the same order as they are on the control pad, so the one furthest away at the top is triangle, etc. The one on the right circle, but... Just made it a little bit more difficult. I didn't explain that very well at all. Okay. Ah, the Infomaniacs here. I, I'm, I'm really tempted to start doing the obvious joke, make, making it even more obvious, but I'll not bother. Right, so we need to go to the Mummy's Tomb. I didn't pay attention to what he just said. I was thinking about the uh, bad joke I was going to do. No, for God's sake, more, uh, more puns there. Yeah, I think, we, I think we got the idea. It's behind a locked door, so you'll need to go to the room of the matching mummies and find the key. Okay. You almost forgot. Go on. Page at the mummies tomb and a page at the oasis. I've just heard that there's page in the jungle. There's going to be a pun for that one. I don't know what it is, though. So you to go to the oasis. So the oasis, mummies tomb and jungle we need to go to. We'll take the boy plane. We'll throw it on the barbie. Dr. Kilroy, if you loan your speedster to Pepe, you can meet us there. After he's finished here. That sounds nice. Right, there's Dr. Pepe will meet us at the Oasis. Can I skip this or do I actually need to listen to it? I'll get a ride in the back of the plane. I thought we got in the plane at one point, but I may be wrong. I'd... No, that'd be nice. I do like it how when the uh, the screen shows the person that's not talking, so it looks like uh, <laughs> looks like she's talking with a, a man's voice. We'll have you for it. We'll meet you. We'll meet you at the biplane. By the way, this is this is this is taking far too. This is more complicated than it should be. Right, so we've got a page in the um, oasis, a page somewhere else, I've already forgotten, and we need to go to the jungle, and we need to go to the matching mummy's tomb. So where's that? Is that here? Let's find out. I'm assuming it is. I can't many more places to go. Was this, am I going to be whacking snakes again? I hope not. This wasn't the snake whacking place, was it? Here we go. Right, match Okay. Mini games going. Knock on lid, open. Okay. Sure, this will make sense when I start doing it. Um. Right. Blue. Oh, right, yeah, I remember this now. Blue and green, right, so they don't match, so they disappear. So, orange. Right, so we're going to, yeah, so we're going to find pair, coloured pairs, green, okay. Red. That went wrong. And red, that was fortunate. Uh, okay, we'll start the end again. Yellow. We're just going to keep knocking until we get pairs. We've only got so long green. Right, green. Where was green? It was over here somewhere, wasn't it? Uh, was it this one? Was that blue? That was blue. Flip. So green. This one was green then. And we've got the other green one was... Was it? Oh, I forgot where it was now. Was it the second one? There we are. Now what's this one? Please be blue. No, orange. Forgot, I feel it, for Pete's sake. I really forgot where these are in. These skeletons are annoying. No, that was blue. Right, so knock on that one again. 
Where's that ball you've got to avoid? No, I've gone the wrong one, you moron. Right, blue. Come on, we can do this. And blue. Pink. Yellow? No, okay, so what was it? Pink, wasn't it? So let's try and find the pink one. There we are. This is the pink one, isn't it? So we got left. We've got yellow and another colour, I believe. Orange, isn't it? So orange. That one's yellow. Is it that one? Yes, it is. And last but not least, yellow and... Remember the back of the coffin so we don't get hit by those skeletons. Yellow. Now what do we do? Now we have to avoid the boulder. Right, I've got the key. Now can I get the secret? Where was that boulder? Ah, there we go. Oh, sugar lumps. Okay. This is going to be fun, isn't it? Right, so we need to remember where these are falling. Faster we're falling, we're running in circles again. Come on, run! Flipping it, that was close. Yeah, bronze, I'm not surprised. That, that, that last bit was difficult. You've got to remember where the... No, we'll not retry. You've got to remember where the... Uh, which side the uh, those things are going to drop. What? don't know what you'd... Uh, oh, dear, excuse me, I don't know what you'd call them. Pillars or something, I don't know. Oh, what a glorious day. It was hammering it down earlier and now it's bright sun. So, so much so. I've shut the curtain so I can actually see what I'm doing. Only just made that one. We got bronze though, so that's, um, it's good enough for, uh, it's good enough for me, that one. That's one, so that's one page down. So we've got the, so we've got the tomb, uh, matching mummy's tomb thing. So now we need, um, we need to get this car, don't we? I think we, we were loaned this car, weren't we? No, oh, another, going to be another mini game, is it? So we've got the oasis and the jungle to go to. I really do need a. I really do. I know I keep saying it, but I really need a song for this. Uh, I need something to fill the airtime when this screen's on. Race to the oasis. Fortunately, uh, no, it's another mini game. Race the oasis, avoiding any obstacles along the way. So what we're going to do? Steer left, steer right, accelerate, brake, and oh horn! Don't know what you need that for. Okay. We need to collect bricks on the way, I think we maybe do. Oh, you get a boost. Don't miss that one. What was break? It was square, wasn't it? It's harder than it looks. Weave through the... Uh... Miss that again. Oh. This is actually harder than it looks. Maybe I'm just not very good. I don't... No, no, don't hit the cactus, you... Miss that somehow. <sighs> On the outside. What do these red things do? Oh, come on. I'm sorry, but... What the hell was that? I, I, I was nowhere near that. I don't, I don't know why it suddenly veered me towards that. I think I'm going to be doing this one. Uh, maybe doing this one again. I've got spaceships trying to shoot us. That was fortunate. No, I need that boost. I got it that time, finally. Ah! No, okay. Now we're dropping cows in front of me. <laughs> What an interesting obstacle course this is. How long's left? I suspect quite a bit because I hit quite a few obstacles there. Although, oh, we're here. Silver for that? That was rubbish. I'll take it. 
that was a really easy one to get goal on. And that, that was rubbish. I, I, I felt like I hit everything and I missed all those boos. I don't, I don't know what the red bricks did there. I don't know what the green ones did, but... Yeah, well, whatever. We got there in the end. So we've got... We've been to the match in, uh, match in Mummies. We're now at the Oasis. And I'm desperate trying to think of a pun. No. No, it's gone. There must be something, I don't know. Okay. Uh, right. So there's a Constructopedia page here somewhere. And of course the camera angle is no use whatsoever. So where's the Oasis? Right, that's the helicopter. Looks like we're back where we, uh, back where we began. I just one of the... Is it supposed to be a page here somewhere, or is it supposed to be? A, is it going to be like a, obtainable in a mini game? Because we're back at the oasis, the gate's shut again. Oh, there we go. What's that? Oh, more gems. Another gem. We look like we've gone back in time. We look like we're back to the uh, the beginning bit, which is not good. So where's this page? Is this where you fly the biplane? And they're over here somewhere. Okay. Caught a big fish. Well, I don't know when you did that. Okay, has something gone wrong? The doctor's got heat exposure. I've heard of that before. A friend of mine's a talent agent, and he said you could die from exp. Oh, for Pete's sake. Yeah, I mean, if we can, I mean, you know, I know it's ironic given the fact how funny I try and be, but, jeez, Louise, <laughs> take the biplane. We could take the doctor in the seaplane where it's a little cooler. Follow us. Way cool. I got to play a biplane. Life is good. Now this is what this is one of the mini games that I I, I forgot about that rally mini game, but I do remember this mini game. I'm sure you have to fire coconuts. At this one, I'm not thinking of the uh, the one we, we've already done with you. Fire them at snakes. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I do remember, I remember to fly, fly a plane. Is it, you have to avoid monkeys or collect bananas or something. Yeah, you collect bananas for fuel. I think you fire coconuts at the targets. So, oh, oh, it's bananas. Okay. All right, so you see, this is this is much like a real plane. So you, well, a real plane. I've never flown a real plane, believe it or not. <laughs> this is much like a plane I was expecting where to go down, you actually press, you press open and vice versa. So accelerate... Square, decelerate, okay. Right, so we need to try and... I'm assuming we've got, I'm assuming we've got a time limit here. What the hell happened there? It's something. Uh, right, we need to get fuel and bananas. So circle slows us down. This is not going very well, I have to say. I'm slightly better at this than I was at Rally. Oh, you suck. There we go, fuel. I was, that's what I was trying to get. I forgot what decelerate. I seem to accept. The accelerating and decelerate doesn't seem to make any difference. What is going on here? Right, I think I may be doing this one again, but we'll see. I was pressing down then and nothing happened. I'm sure you can hit those monkeys. I'm sure, I'm sure you can hit those monkeys with uh, with bananas and it, it flips them round. Much like me, constantly hitting this, constantly hitting everything. Yeah, I do remember this minigame. I thought it was coconuts though, rather than uh, bananas that you, that you flung. Right, what what score do we actually need here? Whatever it is, I don't think I'll have got it. This has been such a bad... This has been so bad. <laughs> this really has been bad. Right, we got there anyway. Oops, that could have gone better, but 
Thanks, Siri. Um, could have gone better yet. We've got We'll retry that. I don't know if they might pick Siri up there for some reason. Uh, he keeps talking to me. Right. Right. Okay. Let's try again. That really didn't go well at all. Um, okay. Let's have another go. Let's go. Right. We're gonna do this now. We've had a practice run for the first time for a while. I've actually done a practice run. I think the the problem there was I wasn't braking and accelerating uh, very well. I think that was the uh, that was one of the issues. I don't quite know what. I mean, we're trying to save. We're trying to save. Um, we're trying to save a guy from heat exhaustion, and we mother his mother like me hit me hitting enough targets with some bananas. I'm not quite sure where his priorities are, but there we go. I think if you crash, do you lose points? That may be what did it. I'm not quite sure. How many bananas have we got? We've got quite a few, which is good. Some more fuel. Oh, are we low on bananas? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Plenty of targets here. Try and hit all these if we can. Or as many as we can. I'll just miss them all that like we have done and fly into one of them. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. The, I don't know what score you need for. Uh... There we go. Load up. I don't know what score you need to get it to register, but. I'm guessing it's about. I think. I think. I think you can get about ten thousand on this if you're. Uh, if you're a lot more competent than I am, it seems. I don't quite know. Plenty of fuel, so it's a bother getting fuel. Plenty of bananas as well. Just focus on whacking these targets. I don't know if they might pick Siri up then, but apparently, uh, whatever I said, I, I said something that. Uh, Activated uh, him or it, whatever you want to call it. Now we're at the end this time, let's see what. Okay. Let's see if that's good enough to get a score. There we go, silver, that's better. One good thing about this. One good thing about. One good thing about this game is. Um, if you you don't you don't have lives, you can't lose lives. It just basically you just basically take as many attempts as you want to do things. So. Uh, that's quite useful, right? So we got through that eventually. That was uh, that was painful, wasn't it? Really, that one. But we got through it. That's the main thing. I'm, I'm, I'm a bit concerned where this page is. I don't think we can leave the island until we've done everything we needed to. So the fact we haven't got the page yet, I'm not too concerned. So I'm pretty sure it won't let us leave until uh, until we uh, till we get it. One thing I don't get though is why. Oh, there's a dinosaur. Uh, no, that's a shark. I thought it was a page, and it's a shark. The one thing I don't quite get is the why. Why that gate? Where those gates are shut all the time? Let's like, just leave them open. Then we can we can access everything. Then can't we? We can access all the island. Right, let's talk to these dudes again. They'll tell me what we need to do. Uh, not really. Right. I think the next thing we need to do is something to do with this dinosaur. Everybody walk the dinosaur. Where is he? The camera angles on this game are so irritating. Where's that dinosaur gone? Um. Where's the dinosaur? We don't need to go in there. There's some sharks over there. There we go, dinosaur. You don't say, okay, let's do this. The T-Rex has just informed me that the dinosaurs have been held prisoner in the... Oh, I vaguely remember this minigame. So dinosaurs can talk, apparently, in the Adventure Island. If someone can rescue them, he will take them there. Here we go. So we're going to... Minigames galore, it seems, this episode. Still no song for this. <laughs> Still no song for this screen. Don't know what the hell that Siri thing was. I don't. I don't know if the mic picked that up or not. I'm assuming it probably did. 
Gather the T-Rex to come and use the main camp. Because this isn't the mini game I was thinking, but there is one. Coming up, right, accelerate. Oh, not accelerate and decelerate again. Uh, jump, jump, the Mac Dad will make you jump, jump. And we can growl as well, which I don't think will do anything. I wonder if, I wonder if on the uh, the rally one, if I'd used the horn, if things would have gone out of the way. I don't, I don't know, I doubt it. Okay, so it's a bit of a... Bit of a... Uh, to avoid these balls then, don't we? Not like that. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to jump uh, with this thing, clearly. Oh, there we go. How are you supposed to avoid that? Oh, well, there we are. Right, we're getting a bit of momentum up now. No, that was poor. <laughs> Come on. I'm so bad at these mini games. I think sometimes you actually have to jump. Like on that occasion, for example. Come on. There's only three. There's only. Th there's only three lanes, isn't there? So, I mean, whack nine times. That is not good. You can of course slow down as well, which I maybe should do. Uh, I think this is another one I'm going to be doing again. Do it all over again and actually try and uh, do it properly this time. There we go, getting a bit of speed up now. Nope, okay. 11 wax. Which isn't good. Maybe I should slow down as well as speed up. There we are. Timed it a bit better. Should I jump to the right time then? You, know, you have to jump over that and that and not that because you jump into the <laughs> jump into the. Uh... It's not fun. It sucks. You can jump. You can jump and change lane at the same time. Who knew? Fifty seconds. Right. I don't know how much further we've got to go. Good, you can jump and change at the same time. I didn't think you could do that. Oh, there we go. We've got whacked 14 times, but we got there. Let me a bronze. Silver, apparently. So, God knows what you, how bad you've got to be to get a bronze. Most people were a little worried about riding a six and a half tons of dinosaur. Well, no, that was just terrible. How many mini games is that this episode? It seems to be uh, that seems to be all we've done. Is uh, mini games? Well, if I one page as well, we've still got another two pages to uh, to find. So we'll get to the end of this loading screen, and then we'll. Uh, I think this seems like a good enough time to stop the episode. Leave you in suspense, ready for the next one. Okay, maybe not. The bricks I mentioned, you might be here. Yeah, looking for something. I wonder. Oh, he's got a he's like Abu Hamza. Yes. What a pity. You've got to go through me to get it. Right, the uh or a pirate. Long John anyway. Um not literally uh, yeah, okay. Rescue the dinosaurs by Rescue the dinosaurs by winching them say I do I do remember this minigame. I forgot about the uh, riding the T Rex one, but I do remember this one. Use winch sandbags. Okay, move forwards, backwards. Right. Right, we have to... Yeah, okay. So we have to now try and... So we basically, we have to fly this thing. There we go. Pick up the dinosaurs. And then put them back on that zone thing. Where's that zone thing? I'm already lost. Which isn't good. While well, he rides a giant Brontosaurus or whatever it is. Brachiosaurus, I don't know. Uh, 
and knocks us off with fireballs. Where's the where's that where's that red and blue thing that we were on over at the beginning? There we are. <laughs> Took long enough. Looks like there's no time limit for this, which is good. That's one saved. Does a lot of there's a time limit anyway, unless there's one uh, in the back Ooh, that was lucky. Unless there's one in the back gun that we can't see. Yep, yeah, that shouldn't have happened. Spent too long in one place there. I thought well, you could pick these up. There we go. That took far too long. That's why we got hit with something. I didn't lose any points or anything. I'm quite sure I'm there. Right, more rescued. Uh, okay. Yeah, like I said, I do, do, I do remember this one. I thought they were all... Uh, I forgot they were like big ones like this. So I thought they were all those little... Little green ones, little kind of baby, uh, baby T Rexes. I think if you get hit, um, I'm assuming if you get hit while you're holding a dinosaur, you end up dropping it. But I may be wrong. Right, four more. So if we go logically, I'm guessing there's one in the middle of here. Yes, there are. I can't hear what he's saying, so it's no doubt be something unfunny. I don't. Get, I, I do like the running. I do like the on-running theme, though, of labouring jokes. Of mean, you know, explaining the words that have two meanings, explaining which version you mean. Like, oh, I saw you over there, and I don't mean I cut you in half. Oh, brilliant. Um, you don't say. I'm still. I still can't quite get over infomaniac, but uh, anyway. Um, there's something in here. I've already got this one. Yeah. There we go. These dinosaurs are returning to the wild where they should be left in peace. Yeah, dinosaurs should be in the wild. Well, if they were, we'd be in a bit of trouble, I think. I'm gonna go too close to the uh, the lava. Right, two left after this one, and they're both at the back somewhere. There we go. It's you safe. Ooh, that was close. There it is, this giant fire-breathing Brachiosaurus. So that dinosaur clearly doesn't need saving. Get the old tri Triceratops. Reminds, reminds me of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Triceratops. What a great program that was. One of the first programs I, one of the first programs I can remember watching. My concern here is, what's that in the top left corner? Those little three... Is there something else I need to grab here? Some, he said something about sandbags, didn't he? Uh, on the, uh, to pick up dinosaurs and pick up sandbags. So where are those sandbags I'm supposed to be picking up? No, no, my pride and joy. Don't take him away. Your pride and joy? Why have you given him such a small pen, then? If, he's like, if you like him, you'll, if you'll be kind to him. I don't know. No, we're taking the uh, the scenic route here. Yeah, Tyrannosaurus as well. It was another uh, another Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles special. Right, this is the last dinosaur. I feel like there's some sandbags or something we need to do. Oh, now, oh, no, now that's lit up. So now what do we need to do? So there's something else. Ah, right, okay. So we're dropping sandbags. I'm assuming it's on him, yeah. That's... There we go. That's one in the rear for Mr. Hate. Brilliant. Didn't explain what, didn't explain what it meant by rear, though, did it? Which is nice. Yes, yeah, so we dropped sandbags on uh, on the guy, so we knocked him off the uh, dinosaur. Uh, no, we'll not retry. We got a gold on that one. I, I don't think you can not get gold on that one because you're not against the clock. I don't think so. And until you do everything, you can't move on. So I think you've got to get gold. Is that the first time we've got gold? 
Can't be. I think I must have got it on one other one, but it's not happened not happened as often as I would have liked. I'm quite rusty. It's weird. I was I was better at computer games when I was younger. Maybe my, I don't know. Maybe my uh, reactions were better. I don't I don't quite know. This episode is 35 minutes. This is this is way too long. I'm not doing another bad Australian accent, so I'm not even going to try. Thank you. Oh yes, I will. Thanks, Peppy. You're a good. Yeah, okay. A real hero. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Very true. I've taken the liberty of preparing your transport home. I hope you like flying. Well, that's how I got here, so uh, <laughs> if I don't, then there's a bit of a problem. Thanks a lot. We've avoided the sharks, of course, in the background there. I won't say I'll miss you, but I wasn't trying to... What the hell? So I'll see my, uh, my hair and my forehead through, the, uh, through my cap, which is nice. Right, so we are... Now, I believe we can go home. Oh, ah, there we are. There's the dinosaurs in the wild. So where's the plane? Is it over there? I don't know. Anyway, we'll do that next time. We'll return home. So we're going back to Lego Island on the next episode. We'll do that in the next episode. This episode's gone on a little bit longer than I wanted it to, but it doesn't matter. Plenty of minigames. We've freed all the dinosaurs. I'm assuming we've done everything we need to do on Adventure Island. So we'll, uh, we'll, we've, we've still, we'll be leaving it behind, but we've still got the memories, of course. So that was episode number five of Lego Island 2. If you enjoyed this episode then please like and share the video. You can also leave a comment on the episode as well if you wish to do that to tell me how much you enjoyed it. Uh, also, if you head on over to the channel, The Uncommentator, you'll find the rest of this series. It's going to be on a playlist. You'll also be able to enjoy plenty of other videos that I've made of plenty of other games. There's uh, quite a nice uh, range of games building up now on the channel, so feel free to go and check those out. I think, hopefully, if you enjoy that, you'll enjoy those too. But join me next time. We're going to be moving on. Episode number six. We'll be flying back to Lego Island and then seeing what we have to do after that. I'm not quite sure what it is, but I guess we'll find out. But until we get to that point, for now, it is Sayonara. <laughs>